So we've released part two, which is misunderstanding the null hypothesis and knowledge. So the main focus of this video was indeed to address the misunderstandings with the null hypothesis. Um, it does cover off what a hypothesis is and all of that sort of thing. And it then goes into the common misunderstandings of the uh, null hypothesis. Um, so there are different claims people make about the null hypothesis, like uh, atheism is the null hypothesis, or God doesn't exist is the null hypothesis. And, you know, I'm an atheist myself, but uh, I disagree because of what the null hypothesis actually is and how it is used in statistics and science. And unless you're redefining what the null hypothesis is, you're not using uh, what the null hypothesis is. And there are a lot of people who are using scientific language to say things, and they think they're using it correctly because they've heard someone else say it, and they're not. And then it also addresses a number of other weird statements made by Matt Dillahunty. So if you go to answersinreason.com, it's currently uh, on the front page. It's the second article down it's called Misunderstanding the Null Hypothesis and Knowledge. Check it out. Let me know what you think and have yourself a good one.